New at five, the local sheriff's office is bringing in a very unique way to train officers and the public behind the wheel. Yeah, you're getting a look right here. The Rogers County Sheriff's Office is using driving simulators to improve safety. Fox 23's Tony Motors Zitsky is live with how this virtual technology is expected to lead to better drivers on the roads. Time. Shay and Sarah, times have definitely changed. When I was in driving school, like way back when, 15, 16 years ago, it was very textbook based. I sat in a classroom for what, six hours? And now teens can actually get a driving simulator before they go ahead, get behind the wheel and take off. It may look like a video game at an arcade. And I see it. I have to stop really hard. But Rogers County Sheriff's Office is trying a different approach at driving safely. You can simulate different driving conditions, different traffic conditions. You can simulate highways, city roads, county roads. Uh, you can simulate anything you can think about you would encounter while driving a car. Patrol Corporal for Rogers County Sheriff's Office Chris Houston says the idea came when he was helping train new deputies and when it came to driving the patrol cars he wanted a different way to train. We can have our driving training but without the risk of damaging cars, putting wear and tear on cars, uh, or possibly the, the, the injury that may occur if you, you, know, you wreck a car. He says in the academy, new deputies only get a week's worth of patrol car training. He adds this is a way to continue training for when deputies hit the road. This will give them more training. You know, during their training program at the sheriff's office, they have strict categories that they have to accomplish before they're released on their own and I possibly want to add the driving simulator into that program to where it'll benefit our public safety because our deputies will be better drivers. Not only is it a training tool for deputies but civilians too. Yeah. Whether you're a teenager yeah. preparing to get your license or a young adult who's timid to getting behind the wheel, it also simulates drunk driving. As you can see it has three screens set up. Mm -hmm. It will actually emulate what it looks like to be intoxicated. Your peripheral vision on the screens will be taken away from you. The camera will actually move around like you're swaying back and forth while sitting in a car. Mm -hmm. it, it will make it hard for you to, to drive. The car itself will try to veer off the road. For the public who may be interested in taking some of these driving simulator classes, the Roger County Sheriff's Office will post them on their Facebook page. Live covering news that matters, I'm Tanya Motorzitsky, Fox 23 News.